welcome back to a vlog since when god knows how long but yeah i was supposed to do some checking in in the morning before i took off on this trip by the way guys i'm in budapest from the title of the video you already know and sorry i don't have the energy that i should bring to the intro of this video but i've seen hell today people of god anyway in summary i took a road trip to budapest because my flight was cancelled due to the german strike the german airport strike and because of that my flight was spontaneously cancelled last night so i had to find an alternative which was to take a train from germany to czech republic from czech republic to budapest and trust me when i tell you that it was not funny it was like two, for a total of nine hours and when we were leaving um czech when we were leaving germany for czech republic the train was late by 30 minutes and that meant we couldn't catch up the connecting train so i waited in czech republic for two hot hours people of god and it wasn't funny so i'm like dead beat i couldn't even vlog my the coming right because i was angry i was sad i was tired of being in the train for that long I just wanted to come in here and relax like and um coming into this apartment i'm really happy like it's giving what it's supposed to give it's very cozy and you know very clean very spacious as well and very bright i like it and it's actually also very much it's in the city center as a matter of fact so I'm happy about that and i'm actually going to do some resting now i'm super super tired i'll get something to eat and then i'll catch up with you guys tomorrow morning Hi guys, um, so I'm out and apparently it's a public holiday in Hungary today and there's really not much happening. There was a parade this morning but I was watching it from my window anyway. But I'm just trying to see what and what I can see in the city today. So yeah, let's go.
Okay guys, uh, I'm at the St. Stephen's Cathedral. Most capital cities have one. Even if it's not a capital city, a lot of them have one. So, let me go in and see, even though I'm compelled to, but yeah. Yeah, let's go in and see what's like. Hi guys, so up next is <laughs> up next is the um what was the most it's parliament yeah the Hungarian Parliament. I don't know if it's open shall but let me go and start present and take pictures. If it's open I shall go inside. If otherwise I'll show you what it's like <laughs> from the outside. Hungarian Parliament building. Uh, I can't go in because there's a queue down there behind to get the tickets. And Daughter of Zion has other things to do. So yeah, this is what it looks like from the outside. Ladies and gentlemen, the Hungarian Parliament building. Stylishly see the long line of people that are waiting to enter the parliament building and I'm wondering what in the world could be inside there that's so fascinating for them to want to see <sighs> whatever it is I'll pass and you people are looking at me like you've never seen someone with a camera before I don't know why but I don't care I love it
guys so um it's the second day and i came out pretty late it's almost 4 pm so i don't really know how much i can see today really and it's like my last day here so whatever can be seen will be seen it's still next to mad <laughs> I'm up at the Fisherman Bastion. I'm up at the Fisherman's Bastion. Bastion. And man, this is a serious. That's gross. This is a serious walk of fame. Like, I hate stairs in places like this. It's actually like a castle, but yeah, let's go. activity for the day and of course for the trip and that is catching a boat ride even though it's um it's already it did not there was no sun today so it's not like catching any sunset shot which was the idea it's um seeing the sights of budapest at night on a boat i hear it's exciting and beautiful so let me see for myself Forever, forever 